Hey everybody, it's Hari Swaminathan from OptionTiger.com. I wanted to do a review of uh, the past uh, week on uh, the SPX uh, ticks and uh, the uh, uh, custom RSI indicators. Uh, yesterday, the markets were up in the pre-markets. And uh, so yesterday, meaning that would be October 1st. But then it quickly turned negative. And as you can see, there were some very, very good opportunities. You want to catch uh, the SPX and the custom RSI in sync. And here you can see somewhere over here, you can you could have taken a trade and it could have come all the way down over here. Somewhere here you would have exited. So that would have been about an eight, I believe an eight or nine point uh, on the move on the S&P, uh, which would be approximately, I would say about $1,600 to $1,800. And then you get, you get another one right here. And if you were sticking in through it, because as you can see, there's only one green dots. But when you see price action like this, it's uh, it's more prudent to come out and then you can get back in as, as soon as you get two green dot, I mean two red dots, you can come back in. And once again, there was another great trade over here. So that's as far as October 1st. If you go back to September 30th, this is the kind of price action where you really don't want to get into it because it's uh, flatlining near the zero line. And then uh, somewhere here, you, you get an opportunity to, to go on the bullish side. And there, and there is, of course, uh, there's about... Uh, I would say about five to six points on that. And, and so you would take that trade. Uh, really no other chances come because even though these two green dots, you can see custom RSI is not yet in the bullish zone. So not, so there's nothing there. After that, there's nothing for uh, September 30th. Let's go back further. This is September 29th. And here you can see uh, some good opportunities also towards, uh, towards the middle of the day from here on the second bar if you had taken it. At least you could have taken a uh, right about uh, uh, five points or so. And then this one would have been a little better. Uh, you could have gone all the way to about uh, eight to ten points. So uh, once again, another $2,000 trade over there. So with the uh, SPX ticks and the custom RSI, you have to wait for these opportunities and just take the right ones. And sometimes you might get one, sometimes you might get two in a day. But uh, that's how it becomes very explosive because... Uh, you know, those each of these trades can produce a thousand dollars or more. And so uh, and even much more sometimes uh, on, on some trades, you'll see here, look at this trade here on the previous day, which would be, I think, the September 26, which would be last Friday, I believe. Uh, some you know, after this, after the two green dots, if you took the trade, uh, if you took the trade here, uh, here rather, uh, 2974 and then you were riding it all the way to the second uh, dot over here 2981 that's a nice trade over there uh, and then there might have been a, another trade uh, just before that on this uh, on this move right here up until this point uh, so uh, up until this point right there and so that's another six to seven point move and so those are the kinds of opportunities you have to wait for uh, here you can see the market started to go down and if you were looking for a bearish trade, you could have gotten into it, you would have been chopped up. So, you know, every now and then you're going to run into a trade that will chop you up. And the best thing is to keep your risk management very tight and uh, go on with it. So this is the SPX sticks and the custom RSI. You can find more information on the Option Tiger website uh, or you can also see the rest of this video to catch the links to, to sign up for the SPX sticks and the custom RSI. But they, with these indicators, I think I've explained it before, the, the ticks is a cumulative uh, uh, calculation of every stock in the S&P 500. And so this is a very powerful indicator to tell you what the internals of the market are doing for that day. So from a day trading perspective, uh, this is very powerful. The SPX ticks as well as the custom RSI are uh, custom indicators and algos. If you have any questions, you can go to this bit.ly link. Uh, bit.ly slash SPX algo and you can find more information on how to get these indicators. Thank you.